Hey, beautiful people of the Most High God. So the Father wants me to warn you to stay in prayer as much as you can today because today is the day that starts these people's wicked ritual of the winter solstice, right? I'm going to read a little bit about it for you, but this thing goes on for 11 days and today is actually probably the darkest day. They know all of that um, Saturnalia festival. Um, this is where they carry out a lot of rituals and harvest energies against the righteous, against God's people, and fight against light. So I'm going to read a little bit about it, and if you can really stay in your Psalms today and do a lot of warfare prayers and pray for the body of Christ and pray for yourself and your family, and just be very wise and cautious because you're going into a new year, so you should try to be fasting at least every morning. And tonight, through bewitching hours, which is 12 to 4, um, you should be praying. You should be praying in Psalms. You should be, you know, asking God to deliver you, having the Holy Spirit fire around you, and just be praying. Because this, these few days, and especially today, these the workers of iniquity, the children of darkness and disobedience, work a lot of evil. All right? Why is December 21st the shortest day? The December solstice is the shortest day of the year in the northern hemisphere because the sun shines directly on the northern half of the earth and it is the longest day in the southern hemisphere because of the sun shines indirectly on the southern half of our planet. All right? Um, when exactly is winter solstice? It starts the 21st, okay, which is today, every year. All right, what happens during winter solstice? On two moments each year, what are called solstices, Earth's axes are tilted most closely toward the sun. The hemisphere tilted most toward our home star sees its longest day, while the hemisphere tilted away from the sun sees its longest night. That's as far north as you can go and see, and still see the sun directly overhead. But what is it? What is the night, darkest night of the year? It is the Northern Hemisphere's shortest day and longest night set to occur on Monday, December 21st, 2020. But it's this, this day they carry out a lot of evil. All right. We can go to other scriptures. Um, I mean, other um, Saturnalia. It's pagan holidays. All right. Pagan festivals. They carry out a lot of evil today. Look, eight rituals to celebrate on this winter solstice. They tell you how to do their evil rituals, all right? Um, you may want to take time to honor and acknowledge endings and new beginnings in your life in a ceremony or personal ritual. See, they tell people to do evil rituals that both honors your past and clear space to make room for what you wish for. You're not supposed to be wishing. You're supposed to be praying and asking God, wishing are for witches, for the coming year, making an offering and represents the past and gives it to the spirit of fire as a completion iniquity. Do you understand the things that they're doing? What are some winter solstice rituals? Decorate an outdoor edible tree for the animals. Make winter solstice lanterns. Read winter solstice books. Make orange promenaders. Spend the night by candle night. Candle witchcraft. Make a wasal, a wasail, reflect, release, let go, and set intentions for the new season. Not get blessings. Do you understand? What do pagans do on winter solstice? The sacred day, it's no sacred day. It's a wicked day called Yule to pagans celebrating the birth of the new solar year. According to Circle Sanctuary, a prominent pagan group in America, dozens of pagans and druids had to Stonehenge, an iconic site in England, to pay tribute to the sun during the solstice, sun worship. Do you get what I'm saying? You guys got to pray a lot because they're doing a whole bunch of evil sacrifices today. Honor the sun by watching the sun rise or set. Feel the warmth of the sun on your face in a crisp winter day as you watch it ascend or descend into a blaze of beautiful hues. Four light candles or fairy lights to symbolize increase in light. Do you see the nonsense they've been doing? Five ways to celebrate the magic of winter solstice. Magic, witchcraft, sorcery, wickedness. Is winter solstice a pagan ritual? Yes. 
The winter solstice is an ancient pagan holiday known for rituals and traditions that celebrate nature. Nature. And setting one's intention for the coming season. Be careful of these people about do this on December 29th. Do, pray because they're harvesting energy and souls. So pray God have mercy on you. What do you eat on winter solstice? I don't care. But do you get my point? This is a day of evil. It's for 11 days. What does it tell you? Eight rituals for turn off the lights. God is of light. Release, let go. Ask the oracles. Familiar spirits. Purify your space. What? With all kind of iniquity. Create a, sol a solstice altar. You're only supposed to set up an altar for God. Don't let anyone dull your sparkle. Remember, light shines through darkness. What are they talking about, sparkle? Set an intention to spread light. Mix up solstice, you will drink. Okay? Eight rituals for winter solstice. How to make your own light. Can you make your own light? Or doesn't God give you light? Who is the goddess of winter solstice? What is the Celtic name for the winter solstice? What is the mag what is magical about winter solstice? The winter solstice when Lampland comes alive. This special occasion marks the start of shorter days, following more time to experience the night and the magic that comes with it. The northern lights, also called the Aurora Borealis, and the northern lights are a natural light shown in the night sky. All right. Winter solstice happens between the 20th and 23rd, and it's when the Earth's axis tilts away from the sun. But it's the day of the winter solstice varies from year to year and can fall anywhere from December 20th to 23rd, but the 21st and 22nd are the most common dates. The solstice is typically not the coldest day of the year. It's the darkest because they're doing a lot of dark arts. Why do Chinese celebrate the, sinner, the, the winter solstice? How is Dongxi Festival celebrated? The main Chinese winter solstice traditions are worshipping the heaven and ancestors and counting nines of winter. D do you see all this wickedness? Make sure you're in prayer because the people do a lot of evil today. A lot of evil today. Stay blessed.